Tucked into the Cascades, just outside Clay Ellum, Washington, sits a dam that's done its job for over a hundred years. But time always leaves a mark. Kachis Dam holds back over 200,000 acre feet of water. And not long ago, engineers discovered something beneath the surface that would require implementing corrective action. My name is Keenan Arnold. We're here at Cochise Dam. I'm the dam safety coordinator for the Columbia Pacific Northwest region of the Bureau of Reclamation. We came to find out that uh, there was internal erosion taking place inside the conduit. This led Reclamation into its dam safety process to evaluate this risk and eventually, as you're seeing today, modify the dam to address this risk Hi, I'm Oliver Carter. I am a civil engineer with Bureau of Reclamation and we're at Cochise Dam in Washington. What made this project a little more complex is we had to fit the construction into one irrigation off season, which was about eight months. While this project has had multiple phases and multiple contractors, our leadership from the project management team has kept us on time and under budget. As the fix took shape, the work on the ground became nonstop. My name is TJ Seister. I'm the Quality Control Manager for Pipkin Construction. We are at the Kachis Dam uh, Modification Phase 3 project here in Easton, Washington. What made this job different was the work inside the, the dam itself. So a lot of underground in the tunnel work, a lot of, lot of different safety and different kind of challenges that, that come up with that, right? Going above and beyond on this job was, you know, we, we work night shift. We worked a lot of weekends, a lot of 60-hour weeks. The schedule on this job was just jam-packed. So we, we had to work a lot of long weeks, a lot of holidays. It's just a lot of long hours to, to, get, to make sure we made this schedule and make sure that we could you know, make sure all the, the partners in this job stayed on schedule, uh, as well as the owner. We could turn this over to the owner on time. What stands out about this project is the extreme dedication by the government and the contractor to keep this project on time to deliver water to the Yakima Basin. With all hands working through tough conditions, the team delivered results. This project coming in under budget and ahead of schedule really speaks volumes to the team. We had many different uh, contracts, many different items that were critical uh, to doing this project, to reducing risk at this facility. Working with the Bureau of Reclamation on this project was really, really neat. It was awesome. We had the folks out of Boise who were a ton of help really helped us stay on, on schedule and stay on time. It's been a great partnership between Pipkin and the Bureau of Reclamation uh, to turn out this beautiful project. This dam is over 100 years old. We hope it to continue to operate and be safe for the next 100 years and for another 100 years after that. And modifications such as this help to ensure that. The Bureau of Reclamation, along with its partners, completed this critical safety modification at Kachis Dam on time and without disrupting water deliveries. The work was precise, necessary, and grounded in a single purpose, protecting people, infrastructure, and the future of this region. Because safety isn't just a standard, it's a responsibility we carry forward every day. <laughs>